Hey there, what would you do if you won the lottery? Oh, you just won it. Just, just to close your eyes and just imagine if you won the lottery. And your brain starts going in all sorts of places. You start dreaming into, man, I'd get this, I'd buy that. All sorts of things just spread out in front of you like this great big nice dinner. And so some ways, you just won the lottery is a great way to dream into the future, to dream into something that you don't have. I like to do that exercise sometimes with people when they're feeling down. And so I was on a project in San Francisco and this client of mine, he was really well regarded and he was key person in his department. He was running six of the most strategic projects and he was working with me on the project I was working with him on. It was a sales competency development project. You're looking at all the sellers and how to develop their competencies in this Fortune 500 company. And he came in one day and he's usually pretty high spirited, but today he came in and he's like, oh, I was kind of foul mood. Everything, nothing was right. His boss wasn't doing anything right. I couldn't do anything right. And I said, hey, Jack, what's going on? And he said, well, I got passed up for promotion again, again. And he was just so feeling down about it. And I let him just kind of vent. It was great. He just said, hey, you know, blah, blah, blah. This isn't right. This is right. And I just gave him all that space until he kind of wound down and it was kind of done with all the, the venting he needed to do. And I said, uh, Jack, what would you do if, if you could, if you won the lottery? And he said, oh, and he, he almost kind of closed his eyes. He sat back. And he took a deep breath and he said, I would go to a beach somewhere, dig my feet into the sand with my partner next to me. And I'd look up and I'd just bask in the sun. And I could imagine Jack sitting there, his sunglasses on, the, the sun glimmering off his sunglasses. It would be just awesome. And I just felt him being there. And in that pause, I kind of looked at him and I pulled in all the love and energy I could from the universe in this moment and really reached in and said, hey Jack, you just won the lottery. And he realized, wow. And in that very quiet moment, he got misty eyed and he whispered back and he said, thank you, thank you. You know, we focus so much on what we don't have. If I just won the lottery, I'd be able to, I'd have this, all these other capabilities are there. But when we look at that, those dreams, don't let it steal away from the dream you're living in right now, the place you are right now. That you have the capability of, of dreaming into this moment and living in this moment as a dream itself and get the joy and the wonder and the awe of being with people that you love and care about, to, be, to learn a lot of things, even when things are difficult, even when things are really, really difficult, and you're still learning a lot, being challenged, growing, honing the talent that you are, all those things are living into the dream we are in right now. So as we live into our success, as we live into the significance that we're creating in this world, I really beg you to look at living your dream right now. You had to get back to the story. Within one month, Jack had gone to the beach with his partner and he had a marvelous time. He just had such a great mindset to come back and to really grab onto this job again with the love and the talent that he truly was. So I encourage you to do the same thing. And all comes down to this, live 100% empowered, learn deeply, and shine boldly out there. Till next time.